Hello everybody! Today I would like to show you video tutorial how to make fixed media layout. I have used 7 dot Studio Collections Writer's Blog and Ferrano Auto. Here as you can see I decided to prime papers with Finovar Clear Gesso. Later you will see why. Once everything is dried, I took Amo Studio Stencil, Poppy Code Stencil, and in pastel paints from Finovar. The color is green apple. The list of soul supplies is at the end of this video and also on YouTube channel. I have used Red knife, silicone colored knife. The impasto paint is very thick, so it works wonderfully with the stencils. Now I decided to use paper texture paste from Pinover and tick mark stencil from Amor Studio. The silicone brush I use is from Pinover. Once everything dried, I took cold and high flow transparent paints, Hansa yellow, medium, and phthalo green. I mixed them to receive a shade of green that matches in pasta pen. And as you can see, I used a lot of water, so this is the reason why I primed background paper with clear gesso, because I didn't want the water tries to fall. I worked on the background for a while, adding here and there some water or more paint. Now I took some embellishment. This is uh, Almost to the dream catcher. You can see also butterfly and the flowers from Tin Hot Six Stars. I took heavy white gesso from a film bar and uh, covered it a little bit. So you covered the dream catcher um, a little bit here and there because I didn't want it to be. Brown. Now another color of impasto paint, raspberry pink. I used a dry brush. Here are 3D foamies and I use them to create three dimensional effect. I took some tags from Seven Dot Studio Lost and Found collection, some uh, leaves and flowers from Prima Marketing, and the elements I prepared earlier. I took some lace Here is uh, Seven Dot Studio, Verano Azul, a catalogant And 
as you can see, I worked a little bit on the composition. Now I took the distress outside, arrange a quick raspberry. I used, I added some water and colored some elements. So they would be pink. This is a 7 dot studio, cotton candy creams, clear stamp set. I love the branches from this set and I stamped with a black um, archival ink here and there. Before I finish this layout, I uh, I have added also some micro beads. They are listed at the end of the video. Here are some of the studio but not on element stickers that I used also for my layout. The composition is from one corner to another one. Sometimes I can't decide where to put some elements, you can see it on the video. But this is natural creative process. And these are little crystal drops. I added here and there some pink dots. And now I heat gun with glue and I glue down all the dimensional elements. I do it very often because uh, hot glue gun makes the elements so difficult to to show off. And it's very useful. Primo marketing flowers. And that's it. Thank you for watching my video tutorial. If you like it, please subscribe my YouTube channel. You can also visit my website, tushalak.com. Have a great day. Bye.